Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Crafty Simmer and we're back with another episode of Blisscraft Vanilla Season 4. And oh my goodness there guys, so over here, um, I actually had to add on to my stable a little bit. So I added on to like a fourth pin, pin and I added some sheeps because we need sheeps for something very important on my to-do list. So we head downstairs. Where my to-do list is, um, which is all the way downstairs. Oh my good lord! Okay, anyways though, this is what I have to do on my, on it now. It's like I have horse stables, I have to give Jacqueline some dirt, which I'm working on right now. I gotta build up, like, my subscriber barn, I mean my subscriber farm, which will be basically the cat tower, and, like, I'll, like, reproduce many, many, many many cats i have to go back to spawn and see if i can get all of the um all of the breeds of cats so that way we can you know have a beautiful amount of cats over there and then i have to build a shrine i gotta build some houses at mogi's village and then i gotta do some like weird stuff over here too leave crescent more leaves give ali a hundred cats and help moon find a dress a pretty pretty princess dress <laughs> so anyways though out here I have been working on getting my sheep population all built up I, I literally built a little sheep population from just a two sheep which is pretty crazy um, I'm just gonna go ahead here and grab some more wheat so I can grow some so I can get some more sheep okay We're just going to get all of this weed over here, and then we're going to go back and bring the sheep to to the breeding party, and we're going to breed them and get some more sheep and repeat the process until I have enough sheep. Because oh boy, there, boys and girls, we're going to be working on our on one of our first pranks today, which is getting giving Bella a ton of beds. So now in order for this to work, we need tons and tons of beds, which means we need tons and tons of wool. So that's going to be fun. I'm actually going to go ahead and get some shears and we can actually start shearing the sheep. So I'm hoping that I can maybe get like, I don't know, like two or three stacks worth of bed. I mean, you know, like like two or three stacks worth of, sh of uh of um what sheep of wool and then we're going to uh actually cover bella's entire house with beds and i think that's gonna be pretty much pretty fun i actually have to look at her house and see just exactly how many beds i'm going to really need for this project because i just know it's going to be a lot and i mean a lot of work To get all of these sheep to not only give me their wool, but also we'll dye it, get the flowers, and dye all of them into like various different colors, and then hopefully we get like enough to like cover an entire house with just beds, constantly beds. I'm just gonna just keep shearing off all of these sheep and getting their wool off them. Hey. You, come back here. There. And we're just going to go ahead and just head over. And I'm actually going to take a look at Bella's house to see what we can do over there. Um, and kind of guesstimate how many beds I'll need. A.K.A. not at all very close because I'm terrible with numbers and bad with math. It's actually kind of cringy how bad I am at math. <laughs> Alrighty, anyways, I got to Bella's house, and oh boy, this is gonna be fun. So her house is really that big, which is really, which is great, which means I'll be able to do a lot of damage with just a small amount of beds, which is definitely optimal, and I'm ready to cause some mass destruction. <laughs> I wonder what's down here. Oh, there's a, th oh, there's a third floor. She's collected a lot of pillager stuff too, and she got pranked by Bridget and Mogi as well. So I think here we'll just need like a like a few beds. What's in here? Oh, her strip mine. Okay. 
and then we'll just kind of go from there. I am so ready to do this so much. Okay. Anyways, though, we're going to go back, and I'm just going to TP back to my house, and we'll get started on making some damage. Like, holy moly. This girl's gotten a lot done. Like, look at that over there. She has, like, a bunch of sheep over here. I mean, I'm not gonna share them because, like, I don't want it to make too obvious that, like, someone is in here, but, like, look at all these freaking sheep. There's so many of them. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead back, and I'm going to start getting everything set up. Like, wow, she has a lot going on over here. Impressive. Okay. We're gonna go head we're we're gonna head back to my house and we're gonna get started on making the beds for the perfect bed prank. I am thinking about dyeing a few of them in different colors though, but we'll just have to see what happens at this rate. Like this is pretty much a very very intense prank, needless to say, especially for my standards. Now, I'm usually not a prankster, nor do I really do a lot of the pranking stuff. Um, I think this is my first season actually doing a prank, to be perfectly honest. But, like, see, look at that. Look at that. Like, I have, like, all these beds now, and <laughs> I really, really hope that when Bella logs on, she will get to be like, what the hell just happened to my house? So... I don't know. Maybe we'll do like two double chest worth of beds and then we'll call it a day. So I mean like that's a lot of beds. <laughs> that's a lot of beds. That's like a that's like at least four inventories full, which means it's gonna be like four walkbacks to this to this damn place. I might need to find a horsey. That might be my next goal is to find a horsey. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you all. Once I, you know, have everything figured out and stuff, like, this is going to be a very fun challenge for me. Woo! Alrighty, so, we have collected all the materials that I needed. We have, like, two double chests full of beds. I got Crescent here to help me out with this prank, and this is going to be a great time. Okay, anyway, so, let's go! So, anyways, so, we're going to go ahead here and just go into the... Back into the other hub, and we're going to go prank Bella's house. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> but even though I have Crescent here, so that means so hopefully that will mean that we'll have a lot less to worry about, and we're not gonna be like all like screwed. Okay. Anyways, though, we're going to go head over to Bella's place, which is. Way over on the other side of another hub, which honestly is so long. God help me. My one main fear though is um, that that Bella's gonna log on and see what we're doing and that will just like ruin everything. Oh, I'm really hoping she doesn't. I really love how like in like the subtitles it says eerie noise and that's just really eerie. <laughs> really sketch. Okay. Oh my god. You know, when I last season my nether portal was super close to spawn. This season not so much. It's a very, very long walk. But I mean though it's better than walking from spawn to Bella's in the overworld. Would probably be like a whole day trip. Hey, Annabelle. We're pranking Bella. Oh, there we go. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Okay. Let the beds commence.
This is glorious. Now, a sign. We'll just take we'll just take like a quick chopping of a tree and uh yeah. So we're, we're just gonna take down this uh this tree here and yeah, this is gonna be glorious. I love it. I love it so much. This is so funny. Okay, I'm just gonna make a quick little sign for her now and surprise her. So, we're just gonna go ahead here, and the prank wars has started, I see. Okay, so where is it? Where is it? Does she- Please tell me she has a crafting table somewhere in here. It's probably in here, to be perfectly honest with you. There it is! Perfect. Okay, so we're just gonna make this into logs. Make that into sticks. And then make this sign. Birch sign. Perfect. Okay. So now we're just gonna climb up here and we're just gonna see... Y'all. Uh, anyways. Heard you like to sleep. Enjoy all your new, your new beds. Hikey and Crescent. I heard you like to sleep. Enjoy all your beds, Hikey and Crescent. This is glorious. Oh my goodness, I love it. It's so funny. 